What is alternative medicine? The term itself is a bit ambiguous as it doesn't explain what exactly it refers to. But the answer is pretty straightforward if we put into perspective what traditional medicine is all about. Traditional medicine refers to all methods of curing a disease that has been around since ancient times. This includes all forms of drugs and all kinds of surgery. The concept is that if it works well enough, it can work for you. It is also worth noting that this approach is not necessarily limited to only one medical treatment type. For example, some alternative medicine techniques involve using home remedies and natural products to heal a specific ailment. Some of these techniques are also quite useful when used in conjunction with conventional medicine, such as cancer treatment. So what is alternative medicine? It is a type of treatment that doesn't have specific backing and has no accepted documented biological mechanisms for working. It is also commonly considered quackery, which is why it's so controversial. Nevertheless, many people believe that alternative medicine therapy is beneficial for people suffering from certain illnesses. There are many reasons for this. Some people find it extremely effective at treating a particular ailment, while other people do not. Others don't even believe that it's effective at all. It is up to the individual to decide which option is most suitable for them. Most of the ideas that drop under the umbrella of corresponding and natural medicine, or CAM, were exercised long before what we think about to be the surge of modern-day medicine in the 19th century. Determining the specific beginning of a lot of these strategies is virtually difficult. Records state that Chinese natural medicine goes back at the very least 2,000 years, and proof of reflexology technique goes back to the ancient Egyptians. Even more and more individuals are starting to steer clear of traditional medicine and look for different treatments, regardless of distinct absence of proof in their favor. Provided that many of these strategies are uncontrolled and unable to verify their efficiency, does this usage posture a threat to those determined for aid if traditional medicine has failed them? Research studies trying to gauge the raised use of alternative medication have been a couple of and also much in between. These numbers were represented by the National Health Statistics Report in 2015, which discovered one-third of Americans had actually used different medication. In Britain, a study performed by YouGov in 2015 located a considerable bulk of individuals count on CAM's treatment's performance. The photos listed below programs the outcomes of the course. Unsurprisingly, three types of CAM that many participants thought to be efficient, chiropractic care, osteopathy, and acupuncture, are the only three with NHS authorization. Various other methods have blended outcomes, considering the frustration proof of homeopathy's inefficiency. A rating of 39% shows the real degree to which false information around alternative treatments has spread out. What do you obtain when you take a handful of false information, spray in a touch of anxiety, and also top it off with a little of deceptiveness? Someone was attempting to make a fast dollar. Belle Gibson released her recipe book, qualified The Whole Pantry, and going along with an application, declaring that the cash she made from publication sales would certainly be contributed to charity. It was later on found that she was never detected with cancer. However, just after publication, author Penguin paid Gibson's firm over $250,000 for her recipe book and also sales of her application as well as a publication integrated completed over $440,000. Bell Gibson defines just how an adverse experience with a medical professional pressed her away from traditional medicine, which she states are significantly typical. She examined to end up being a naturopath, drawn in by the possibility of an educational program based upon all-natural medication. The absence of rigorous policy in different treatments contrasted with standard medication highlights a genuine danger. Even more individuals are looking for different treatments as an outcome of an adverse experience with doctors. Are we stunned that individuals are surrendering to the attraction of treatments, such as naturopathy, with guarantees of a preliminary 90-minute visit, as well as lure you in with expressions such as independently matched wellness strategy, as well as an alternative method? Dr. Zubin Damania says doctors currently make even more eye contact with their computer systems than they finish with their people. Did you know that 40% of Americans think that cancer can be treated by alternate treatments alone? 40%. The same portion of individuals in Britain that count on homeopathy performance think that therapies such as acupuncture or homeopathy or consuming raw vegetables and fruit can heal cancer. Several of the ideas that drop under the umbrella of corresponding as well as different medication 
Pam, were exercised long before what we consider to be the surge of modern-day medicine in the 19th century. Records state that Chinese natural medicine dates back, at the very least, 2,000 years, in proof of the ancient Egyptians' method of reflexology even older. Even more, as well as even more individuals, are starting to avoid traditional medicine and look for different treatments. Regardless of a notable absence of proof in their favor, research studies trying to determine the enhanced use of different medications have been a couple of and much in between. These numbers were resembled by the National Health Statistics Report in 2015, which located one-third of Americans had actually made use of different medication. In the end, all we can say is going for professional treatments can be a better option. The rest is totally your personal choice. Many of the alternative treatments have turned out to be successful, but do not put one's health at risk for saving a few bucks.